The management of the bulk oil storage and transportation company has resolved to pass on the cost of any future contamination incidents to the company's depot, uh, depot managers across the country. According to uh, the Africa Center for Energy Policy, ASEP and BOS itself, contamination of fuel has resulted in the loss of approximately $300 million. Executive Secretary of the Chamber of Petroleum Consumers of Ghana, COPEC, Duncan Amua, observed the move by BOST will relieve government of any cost arising out of negligence from the company. It is good that today they are taking stringent steps to ensure that contamination does not even occur. Uh, we believe that per their SOPs or standard operating procedures, contamination is not even possible in the first place, except by certain human recklessness or ill intention to do so. And so once the managing director is telling Ghanaians that those things are being taken care of, it tells us that their operations are going to at least live up to a certain minimum standard as we expect of them. The bulk oil storage and transportation company BOST between 2016 and 2017 recorded increased fuel contamination with its persistent operational losses. The company is also bedeviled with petroleum product diversion and theft. Bost loses some $2 million a month in transmission losses. How fuel losses and evaporations occur at Bost. It cannot be left on set that people bring their products, you charge them throughput charges, and then when the time comes for them to come pick the products, they either don't find the products or the products are commingled with some bad products from other sources. We need to check those things to make sure BOST operates as a first-class facility that importers can rely on, that international oil suppliers can also trade with any day with the sort of confidence that they deserve. Duncan Amwa noted this will go a long way to improve standards at the local pumps. We do understand that a lot of the fuels in the system meet the standard. Others do not. Now, once BOST as a major operator is ensuring that no contamination is occurring here and there, it means that the quality of fuels that Ghanaians should expect at their pumps uh, could be vastly improved. And so we expect him to walk the talk. The bulk oil storage and transportation company's long-term strategic target is for BOS to earn revenue of about $810 million in five years from an expected investment of $180 million.